Welcome Capricorns. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful like, shares, and support. Capricorns, this is the month of March. Capricorn. This is the month of March. Uh, this is a four-week pe period. Whenever you guys pick up this reading, it is time for you to be uh, aligned with this connection. All right. So a lot of you, a new start is going to be coming in. Whatever is happening and transpiring, I see some sort of a new start. News is going to be coming in about you moving forward with a project and I see help is going to be coming in. The hardship is going to be ending. It's going to be over because if you notice, the hardship is at the end. So this is going to be good. There is um, uh, everything about money. I see working together. I see long-term financial situation. You moving forward, collaboration with other people. This is going to be good. Capricorns, then we see... Um, this energy of you receiving a new start and a message is going to be coming in um, for a lot of you, okay? The hardship is going to be over in this month of March. So let's um, get in your reading and see whenever the angel of uh, um, the Ace of One is about the universe, is about the source of all things, is offering you um, some sort of a new start. So when we look at the energy of the Ace of Wands, it's about cosmic energy. It's about the representation of all potential and possibility of creation. And the cosmic energy in, is pushing you in a really positive direction. It is about the inspiration, excitement, and enthusiastic that is going to be coming up. And it is the elemental power of passion. So I see in this month you... Um, Capricorns are going to be having a whole lot of passion, a whole lot of passion. You can see the energy of passion working together, money, recreating possibilities, opening up new doors for yourself. Creativeness is going to be and you're going to be passionate about whatever you are creating. So the energy of passion and um, and creativeness is going to be coming up where a lot of you are going to be very creative and creating a very um, creative business idea or finding creative resolution to issues, problems, and situation. So this is going to be really wonderful and really positive. It's as if the universe is granting a lot of you some sort of a new part, some sort of a new start for a lot of you when it comes up to business. Um, this is going to be good. Then let's look at the cross. We have the energy of the cross of the four of pentacles, um, the victory and success, moving forward, overcoming some sort of a situation. But this is, uh, for some of you, is victory and success. For some of you, is moving forward. As some of you, your project is going to be getting a new life. As, as if some of you, your people are going to be recognizing and seeing your project. Some of you are going to be exhilarating because you change something about your business product, whatever you're doing, uh, whatever you're working on, you have changed um, something about the service of your business that is going to be giving you some sort of a new push in a new direction. So that is going to be good. It is going to be a wonderful alignment of energy where a lot of you are going to be recognizing that this new change needs to be done. We really need to have this new change. This new change really needs to be done. This new change, you recognize that you had to create this new change in order to accelerate some sort of a purpose and change in the way you do things. And people are going to be recognizing that. So it is a wonderful alignment of energy. And you Capricorns are going to be recognizing that the changes that you are making is the changes that you need to make, okay? Um, a lot of you are going to be recognizing the unsavorable situation um, that was happening on the work floor. It's going to be a good, good um, four weeks period for you guys. Um, your passion is at the eye speak. Your passion um, you're using your passion and you're using it high speak. If you recognize there is a lot of money, um, some sort of a news is going to be coming in. 
um, news about you moving forward and a project and a business moving forward. I see that you're also going to be recognizing that some sort of a financial situation, people are going to be working together with you in order to resolve this situation. Um, so um, if a lot of you are looking for loans and that sort of a thing, it is going to be happening. It is definitely going to be happening um, in this month. If a lot of you wanted to merge, merge with a business, it is definitely going to be happening. It is going to be happening in this month. At the end of the month, you're ending this month, ending the hardship that you have been going through. So if you notice the energies um, of this month, it's very, very beautiful at the workplace. Um, it's beautiful for business and at the workplace. Some sort of an information is going to be coming in. Whatever this information is, is coming from some sort of a bank financial institution wanting to collaborate and work with you on a situation in order for a situation to move um, forward and to move in a positive direction, okay? When we look business, whatever business, whatever project that you're working on, it is going to be very good. I see um, a lot of you are going to be reconnecting and people are going to be helping. If you're looking for a new job, people are going to be coming in and it's going to be helping you to board out a situation and to bring some sort of a balance um, to some sort of a situation that has been happening and has been created. So this is going to be good. So it is an absolutely, absolutely um, positive, positive four weeks period that is going to be transpiring because I see people are going to be wanting to collaborate with a lot of you. So let's look at um, uh, what is transpiring. So as we look at the first week, the first week is that some sort of a news is coming in, in the first week, okay? Um, and this, this, this news that is going to be coming in, um, it is some sort of a message is coming in in the first week, okay? And the message is coming in, embodied in you, okay? So it is as if it is some sort of a personal message, okay? Because this is a personal situation where whatever the message is coming in is as if uh, you're being advised of something. The page of one's embar em em embodies communication, okay? And it has to do with some sort of a creative, some work, some process, some um, work that you're on. Maybe it's a project. Um, some sort of a new project is going to be coming in. I, I, I see people around that is going to be wanting to collaborate um, with you guys. So that is good. So uh, expect some sort of a news in the first week. Um, some sort of a message is going to be coming in. If some of you apply for a job, some sort of a message is going to be coming in to you. Okay. Something that you were waiting on and that is going to be good. As um, we look at the second week, we have movement, okay? A whole lot of movement, a whole lot of transition that is going to be um, happening and a whole lot of movement and transition, okay? So, um, you know, like going on a quest, a whole lot of movement, transition. People are going to be wanting to work with you and collaborate with you on some sort of a job, something that has not... Uh, been moving is going to be picking up in the second week and there is going to be some sort of a movement that is coming up in the second week okay and that is going to be very very good in the third week you are dealing with a, a project and um whatever the project is and whatever that was transpiring um this is going to be good because this project is depicting the hard work that has come before the riches and the rewards. So a lot of you that was working on a project in the third week, you're going to be recognizing um, that this project is going to be picking up and you're going to be seeing the rewards of this project. So if some of you were working at a company for a very long time, they're going to be finally seeing the work that you're doing, okay? I see a lot of you are going to be finding determination um, to, um, you know, deal with something and finish something. You're going to be, um, finishing up a whole lot of work that you had to do. You're going to be focusing mainly 
on your work and leaving the rest behind, you are definitely going to be focusing on your work, okay? It's as if a lot of you uh, who have been looking for a job or that sort of a thing, you're going to be focusing. What we see is Saturn in Taurus, okay? So in the third week, it's going to be Saturn in Taurus. So there is going to be changes. If you're a manager or a business owner or self-employed, I see some sort of a changes is going to be coming up in your daily duties at the workplace. Okay, so this is going to be good. It is actually very, very positive to recognize what is going to be happening and transpiring. And I see if some of you were looking for a job in the second week, you can apply, doors are going to be opening and you're going to be moving forward in a really positive way. Then we see the energy of the Six of Pentacles in the last week. So the fourth week, the energy of the Six of Pentacles is this good. It is about promises is going to be honored and a reorganization is going to be coming up, okay? I see people are going to be respecting a lot of you Capricorn and admiring you for the work that you have done. And I see Jupiter in Leo, Jupiter in Leo. So this is um really wonderful and 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 positive. And in the month, the, the four weeks period with Jupiter in Leo, because this is uh, this is a positive alignment of energy. We have uh, um, Jupiter in Leo is is letting you know that respect and admiration is going to be coming to a lot of you Capricorns because you showed up uh, some sort of an unconventional situation that was transpiring at the work floor. And in uh, your career, you're going to be moving up the, the ladder. So it's as if you were being blocked um, or, you know, people were standing in your way. This is going to be opening up. It's as if new doors are going to be opening up. And whatever the blocks that was there, um, you are, it's as if you're taking back your powers. Okay. And this is going to be good. So, um, you know, the, pin, the, the pinnacle of this, this month in business is going to be depicting the harmonize and stability that comes from, uh, close and communication partnerships, a whole lot of partnership. Okay. So we're seeing, um, harmony and stability. Okay. That comes from, a, a close commitment and partnership. So a whole lot of, um, people who commit and partnered with you is going to be working with you to collaborate. So a whole lot of positive, uh, energy on the work floor. Colleagues are going to be really, um, coming in, um, and showing their love towards you. Venus in Harris. Okay. So this is good. So, you know, as you see the crowning off, uh, um, your, um, business, uh, you know, at work, uh, uh, business career is, is, is about harmony and, and, and harmony and stability. And it's about coming from a really positive place where a whole lot of, uh, communication and partnership is going to be created where I see your colleagues are going to be honoring you and, and respecting you for the work that you're doing. Okay. Your comrades is going to be honoring you and respecting you for the work that you're doing. So I see a lot of you are using your Leo energies in this month in order to balance, um, situation. Your career is going to be moving up the ladder and people are going to be, um, seeing that you are very, very successful at what you do because you have a lot of, uh, um, expertise, uh, um, about your fact, you know, you're fully rounded in your career. You know, you have so much expertise in your career. So if you notice Capricorn, you're going to be creating your own wealth. The only people who are going to be having a problem is people with travel, people with, um, travel, um, with, with car dealerships. You are going to be really having problems. So people with car dealerships, you're going to be having problem. Anything to do with car dealership, anything to do with travel agency, whatever, anything to do with travel, um, any business to do with travel, you are going to be the ones who are going to be having and coming in some sort of a problem. For the rest of the Capricorns, I see people are going to be 
Eredin and achievement and accolades is going to be um, coming in for some of you, but also um, success overcoming um, problems and issue. Okay, I see you're going to be receive a new offer at the end of the month. Some of you are sometime in this month. Some of you are going to be receiving a new offer. Okay, people are going to be wanting to invest and. Um, be partnerships with some of you. A lot of you are going to be rewarded a lot of profit. Okay, so we see Mars in Capricorn. So this is lucky. This is going to be a lucky month for you guys. Mars is in Capricorn. This is good. Capricorn in um and and, and this is this is absolutely positive because this is Mars in Capricorn and it's standing in the upright and this is the foundation. Um, that, you know, you are standing in your own true power. Uh, you don't need anyone to tell you, but you're standing in your own true power. And this is about enterprise, partnership, investment. So, okay. And this is going to be extremely good. Mars in Capricorn, you're standing your power. This is in your foundation. And what is, um, your pinnacle, um, your pinnacle is also um eridan accolades okay investments so um savings okay the sun in capricorn so this is absolutely going to be a wonderful wonderful um um timeline because you are dealing with uh, the sun in capricorn and mars in capricorn so you're having stability so, you know, you're not going with the win. These are stability because these are coming up strong. And this is good because when we have uh, Mars in Capricorn as the foundation and the sun in Capricorn as your, you know, uh, your pinnacle, um, people are now recognizing um, that you are aware of who you are and you're very good at your job or your career i do love you guys i gotta go not to worry um you're coming out of some sort of a hardship because people are going to be recognizing your worth so this is going to be good and uh, i want to say to a lot of you if you'd like to see the extended of this reading please follow us to the other side if not i am saying namaste until next time